Hello everyone, Step43 here. Welcome to Fernandez Play Satisfactory. Yeah! Woohoo! Satisfactory. This is a game that I actually was pretty excited uh, to present to you guys. It's one that I've been watching a few videos and streams on, and it looked very entertaining. And we wanted to bring it to you guys. It finally just launched today. Haven't even jumped into it whatsoever. It launched 22 minutes ago, actually. Exactly. So we are jumping right into it. Uh, we put a vote up on YouTube and got over 12,000 votes. 96 or 94 percent was positive on wanting us to play it. So that was actually a pretty good turnout. So with that, that was. with that being said, we're gonna jump into the intro. Guys, it created the session. Scared of you. Welcome back, Bear Ghost. It knows my name. Attention Pioneer. The following instructional video is a summary of your impending duties as an exoplanetary pioneer for Fixit Incorporated. Fixit Pioneers have three cyclical assigned pillars of work to ultimately accomplish project assembly. Use provided blueprints to build the necessary buildings. Chart the planet and gather resources to provide desired results and improve your infrastructure. Make sure to report any unusual discoveries to R&D for analysis. Expand your factories, outposts and pipelines through automation and augmentation. That's it. Get to work and be effective. Warning, planet fall imminent. Please remain seated during full procedure. Atmospheric entry in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Planet fall procedure initialized. I'm currently in Titanfall right now. Blech. suit is at 100%. small step for man welcome to planet Mastar one giant B -B -B leap for satisfactory sector in the binary star system of Akija. Ooh. I, I was quick to join also known as artificial <coughs> I know. Assistant, tasked to support pioneers such as you in their mission you are the third of your sector to survive planet for Akicha. congratulations huh note objective why is that flying in the sky welcome to Where are you guys? Oh no. Um. I don't first see. objective: oh. please dismantle the drop pod. The resulting materials I'm will in be this repurposed field? to construct a habitat and utility base. Oh, from see. now on referred to Ooh. as the hub. There are guys, icons. No, guys, there's something chasing me. Incorporated as cost-effective. Oh god. <laughs> we do not wait. It's shooting things. Press uh, F to I think there's. Oh, there's Tyler. Reveal color <gasps> properties in the What's flower chasing you? <gasps> oh god, what is that thing? <gasps> It looks like something out of Avatar! Oh god, there's something chasing both of you now! <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry guys, I'll get it! I think Daddy's this way! Come on guys! <laughs> oh god, it shoots stuff! Leaving the drop Run! Zone. Note, according to fix it shoots balls of fury! Should have access to a Throw a berry nut at it! Against extraterrestrial threats. <sighs> a berry nut? Yeah, I just picked it off this tree right here. This but a zapper. possesses minor healing properties. Wait, how do we Further zap? Analysis oh. required to establish object scanner identification. Ow! 
You zapped me. Third objective. Please familiarize yourself with the resource scanner to find iron. Brand. Position uh, uh, iron is considered essential in preparation for all future objectives. Oh That's definitely a thing from Avatar. All right, so it's wanting me to press C to scan for resource deposits. Hold E to gather resources from the deposit. Iron ore will be needed for crafting. I'm, where are you guys at, though? We're coming. Um, we're coming. We were we had... taking down an alien and getting it. Yeah. yeah. That's we had weird. To... Oh, God. These things are quick, like giant armadillos! That's, that's weird that it didn't spawn you guys with me. We spawned way out here. Really? Yeah, yeah. We're, I think we're heading towards you. This thing is ramming me! I'm pretty sure he's the green. Brianna, where did you go? You guys just left me with these armadillos! Look at the compass and just follow my... Look at him! Oh, exactly. we're, getting, we're getting chased by like 50... Like, Armadillo things? Here, let's just keep running, keep running. Run to him, run to him. <laughs> They're too quick. Uh, run! <laughs> oh, Damn it, uh, guys, you guys are on your own. Ow. <laughs> Ow. There you guys are. I have like two bars. Help! I see you guys. <laughs> Help! There's nothing there. What are you guys even worried about? There's Figures, literally... The second we get to him, they leave. <laughs> literally, there's nothing there. There's like... All right, come here, follow me. No, all right. Go that way. <laughs> no, I'm okay. <laughs> I'll let you guys. If you zap them, though, you can kill them and get their organs. Come here, so, how do you so get your So if you guys press C. 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 It's pinging iron ore, which oh. is what we need to start. Yeah, that's for the iron ore. Looks like How did I get my zapper out, then? It's There's iron way. way out here. 120 meters this way, guys. It's like right here. Are you guys with me? Yep. Yep. 50 meters. Oh, here it is. So, for oh. those of you who There's know no what Factorio is, uh -huh. this consumable possesses minor They're so quick. Zap. Zap. What are you zapping it with? My zapper. Oh. How do you get your zapper out? Studying Press tab. Oh, wait, hold on. Feature, Mike tab. That's what it was. To defend yourself in the future. I okay. recommend analysis. Press E. Fourth objective. Build the hub. Note: To complete this objective, the resources salvaged from the drop pod. We're just like completed. stabbing it. <laughs> Ensure the hub is built like on busts. a safe open terrain close to the presence of iron sources. Failure to do Ooh. so will likely result in non-optimal. Could you progress. imagine like actually trying to Press mine it with like this little chisel? I'm trying to like. Cause are you guys not getting the tutorial? We are, we are, but I don't think they're listening. Yeah, because I'm trying I'm to trying. listen. They're like talking over it, and I'm trying to like listen to what she's yeah. saying. She's wanting us to build the hub. Okay, so oh. press Q to open the build menu and select the hub. Oh, gosh. This oh, I can see what you're building as well. Yeah. Wow. Hub. Look at the size of this thing. Freaking huge. Okay, so how do we scroll it or spin it around? Uh, um, oh, rotate a scroll. Yep. Okay, so where do we want to put this thing? Uh, I would assume is what what is the hub for? So it says the, the heart of your heart of your factory. This is where you complete fix it milestones to unlock additional blueprints of buildings, vehicles, parts, equipment, etc. So we want to put this somewhere central where we would want to kind of build around it. Sorry, so, but I got to interrupt here. Do you guys not see this big thing flying in the sky? It looks like a kite. The, <laughs> it looks like a We'll just call it the day. we'll just yeah. call it the the zap kite. Zap kite. All right. So, how does okay. this look? Right, like right here for now. Sure. Okay. I just built it. Oh, missing parts. It says. Manual craft bench. You have unlocked hub feature. Manual craft bench. Hub feature. Hub terminal. Fifth objective. Oh. Hub upgrade. Storage and power. Note. The craft bench okay, hub so upgrade the hub by using the hub terminal, the craft objective. parts, and the craft bench. Okay. All right. Um, oh, it says, so multiple people can't be using the crafting bench. Upgrade the hub by using the hub terminal, craft parts, and the craft bench. So where is the, so there's the hub terminal. So you click on tier zero, click hub upgrade. And then you have to click select milestone. And it says uh, milestone cost is 10 iron rods. How do you get For the iron rods? I would assume going over here to the crafting bench, click an iron rod and can't afford recipe. 
it Plus costs... Plus, I actually can't use the crafting bench to someone else's. Yeah. So we need to get more iron, I think, which is... No, so, okay, so in the cra in the crafting bench, I'll let you see it, so that way, since you, you're kind of doing it all, you have to craft the iron ingot, turn the ingot into an iron plate, and the iron plate into an iron rod. Okay, so how many? So I need two. Yep. So one, two, right? And I can craft a plate. Okay, and then an iron rod. Yep. Alright, so maybe I'll just craft all. Yeah, I would just craft as many ingots as you can, and then craft as many plates as you can, and craft however many rods as you can. Because you need 10 rods, so go to hub upgrade. Um, yeah, you need 10 I iron rods. I'll drop all my iron right here on the ground, so if you need it. Yeah, I'll drop my How do you drop it? Just, just go to your inventory it. and drag it and drop. Okay, okay. so I, cra I crafted all the iron ingots. I crafted all well, the iron plates, but I cannot make any iron rods. It says cannot afford. Okay, well here's like all this iron right here. Like literally, like almost like 150 iron sitting right here, so or 120 something. Okay, so let me try this. So I'll go. I'll go collect some more iron for you. Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Okay, I'm crafting. It's not making any noise when I craft. It usually makes like a little, like a little noise, or normally it does. Oh, I can barely hear it. Maybe it's just because I had the volume down. Now I can make 32 yeah. iron rods. How many did I need? 10. 10. Guys, okay. I'm already enjoying this game. Okay, so I just <laughs> I just made 10. Okay, okay so now you go into the, the hub terminal. Oh, I put it in there. Upgrade hub. There it is. Oh. Ooh. Uh -oh. New buildings, new equipment, new parts. Congratulations. Oh, you have unlocked hub feature, biomass generator. Hub feature, personal storage. Scanner feature, copper. New equipment, buildings, and blueprints, which can be found in the workshop when built, build menu, and craft bench, respectively. Okay. Sixth objective, hub upgrade, construction. Note, connect buildings to a generator for power. Note, buildings such as the smelter out of require the a blueprint <laughs> to be set. Advice, automate the smelting process okay. and use portable miners for optimal So results. hold C to select what resource to scan for, build an equipment workshop and craft a portable miner, equip a portable miner and place it on a resource node, build a smelter to automate production of ingots, use the biomass burner to supply power to your buildings. Okay. I like how it like it like tells you what you need to be doing. The girls yeah. are over here just knocking the iron out over here. <laughs> well, I have I have a feeling you're going to need it so that way yeah. you can build like all this other stuff. So I figured I'd get a head start on it. Wait, see so like there... what source to scan for. Oh, so I can choose iron or copper. So here just... you go. Here's some more iron. I just chose copper, by the way, Tyler. I just did too. There's we have an ink. We have a. Wow, so the closest one is 189 meters that way, then we've got one 367 meters that way, and 466 meters that way. So it says, so. so to select which source, and then the second one is build an equipment workshop and craft a portable miner. An equipment workshop? So I hit Q, and it brings up workstations. You can build a craft bench and an equipment workshop, and a smelter. I was just going to say, and the smelter. But Either we need power. power. You can make the power line, and then the special is just a hub. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, so it said to hold C to select what resource, which I did, and then it yep. says to build an equipment workshop and craft a portable miner. So, oh wow, I guess that's what that is. I just saw it <laughs> flying around somewhere. Where yeah, I didn't mean to click it. Oh no, you're fine. Go ahead. So we've got the equipment workshop, which is used to manually craft stuff which we need i think uh we need six iron plates and six iron rods six iron plates so how do we see our inventory is it tab oh yep. tab. i have uh seven iron plates by the way okay so let me go and see if i can craft some more so what do, what, what do we need again um we need six iron plates and six iron rods okay Okay, I think I've got everything now. Okay, so now you should be able to craft it. Okay. Equipment workshop. Wow, this is actually... You can kind of place that wherever you want, honestly. I'd spin it around, face it us. Are 
show you now. Go. How does that look on its evenness with everything? Um, Before I place it? It's not lined up properly. Do I need to go away toward? Away. Um, away. So like right there? A little bit more. A little bit more. <laughs> I just okay, heard now something really scary. Turn it left. Nope, other way. A little bit more. Uh, okay, now farther away a little bit. Right there. That's perfect. Ta da! Oh Bootyful. Alright, so now that we built that, equip a portable miner and place it on a resource node. Where do we get a portable miner? In the equipment workshop. Which costs, looks like, four iron plates, eight wire, and four cable. Eight wire? I don't. I don't have wire yet, so we need copper for wire. That's why we have to go find a copper node now, guys. Oh, okay. So if you guys press and hold C, you guys can choose a copper ore instead, and then it will ping oh. copper, which Tyler mentioned earlier. The closest one is 170 meters this way. It's not that far. It's actually not There's like bad. a weird bug thing over here that was like 30 feet tall earlier, so. <laughs> a weird bug thing? <laughs> it has like long linky legs. I'm kind of terrified of, like, the creatures. Oh, God! Okay, that scared me, that bird. Oh, it's right here, actually. That wasn't Do too far. Do you guys far. collect, like, all of the plants and stuff, too? There's oh, an armadillo thing. thing. It's an armadillo thing. Oh, God. Get it! Get it! Shock it! It's oh. dead. <laughs> Poor thing. Wait, listen he to, the, listen to the beat. You ready? Dink, dink, I'm dink. Off. Sounds okay. like well, I think we have enough copper now okay, between all go. of us. <laughs> all right. <laughs> How do you know? There's still a bee. How do I know what? And we have enough. I just figured that all four of us were hitting that pure one in the <laughs> middle, and then we were all dinking the bottom. There, so. is, there is fall damage in this game, by the way. So don't go jump on. How do you things. get health? So here, I, three bars. I'm gonna drop oh, my here, copper for you. Okay. I will drop my copper for daddy real right, quick, Brianna, so and then I've got some stuff that'll restore your health. I didn't even eat what you gave me the first time, hold on. I didn't realize I still had it. So how many how do wires do we need, it? Tyler? Um, for the portable miner? Yeah. We need eight. Go, eight? We also need four cable. Thank you. Copper ingot. How do you put things on your like taskbar? Okay. How, how, how many wires was it again, Tyler? Um, eight. Know. Eight wires. Yep. Okay. So I've got fifteen wire. What else do we need? Uh, we need four iron plates and four cable. Four iron plates. Okay, yep. We have four iron and cable. Yep. Okay, so I have the, uh, I think I've got everything we need here. We'll see. Um, and Brianna, you were asking about how to put stuff on your inventory or your shortcuts. If task it's, bar. if it's like normal resources, like copper and iron, you can't put that on your taskbar. I'm talking about like the pale berry and stuff. Oh, you just go into your inventory and double click it and then it'll put it in your hand. You can't put things like on your actual taskbar down there. That's stupid. Portable I agree. Minor. Oh, I'm missing one more cable. I thought I had it. I need one more cable. If you need any more copper, there's some in this little storage box right here. This personal storage box. Is it a... Wait, can you guys see what's in here? In this personal storage box? Or is it all just stuff that I've put in here myself? Like three uh, more. Let me see. Three more wires. I think that's... No, I can see what's in there. Do you see There's like the 32 flower see. petals, 39 leaves? Yeah, so I can add okay. Just more sure. flower petals, that. All right, guys, that. I made a portable miner now. Okay. Okay, so now it says equip a portable miner and place it on a resource node. So uh, should might we as well just this? throw it on this. Yeah, I just throw it on this iron right here. It's closest. Okay. Hey, Brianna. And Slot build a here. smelter. You see that little green orb on top of that mountain up there? Um, press E to pick up portable miner. 
press no. E and hold. Oh yeah. Okay, so how Let's do we actually place the miner? Um. Is there any way for us to even get over there? Can be set know. on Let's a resource through. node slot hands. Oh, so I have to put it. Oh, okay. You actually there have to drag it to your character. Got it. And then. Mm. Oh. Oh god. Right what the heck? He's cute. Guy, where'd you guys go? You should be looking at this. We are exploring. We're trying to find more stuffs for you guys. We're trying to find this orby thing. Oh. <laughs> it's the way he just lowers himself into the ground. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so now we have to build a smelter to automate the production of ingots. Now for smelters, we need five iron rods and eight wire. This way, Brianna. So you could probably... Oh, you, you might this? even have all the materials to make that, huh? What? Um, I've got copper, so let me go check. Guys, we found a cave. Wait, you guys already found a cave? L leave it to the girls oh, to God. already go find a cave system. There's some copper ore, there's Ooh. iron ore. <laughs> me. There's mushrooms here. Suggest strong bonding features. Oh. Further analysis required. Oh, huh? okay. I found a bunch of mushrooms. Oh, yeah, it's that stuff. mycelia yeah. stuff. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we're going to wrap up our first episode of Satisfactory before we get any further. Um, I'm actually having a lot of fun with this. You guys will have to let us know in the comments below if you guys enjoyed it, what you guys thought about it. We are just getting started. And uh, if you guys like the video, then uh, drop a like. Let us know. Show us some support. And uh, we'll, we'll keep it coming. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.